too scared to talk to her. Nobody talks like that in real life. What? Hey! Watch those side eyes, Karo! Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts, and welcome to a game whose title will probably get me demonetized so fast it'll make your butt cheeks clap. Oh, God. I actually remember this game from a few years ago. I think I played the demo of it in a free random games video. All right, guys, last game of today's episode has a title that'll probably get me demonetized. So we're just gonna say this game is called Not Alive for Him. I saw my boy Bijou Mike play this game, and I was like, this kind of looks familiar. So I was like, I'm gonna try it out for myself. Bought it, downloaded it, turned on the camera, and now we're here. So I'm gonna try this game out, and we're gonna see what it's all about. If you guys cool with that, you down with that. Everybody get ready and buckle up, cause here we go! I will always remember that day. I was returning home. Mom was alone. No, I was with her. I was. I snuck out through the window, though, cause she didn't want me to be seen. If only I knew, I would've stayed with her. We are alone now. Yeah, we are. Home alone. Awesome, Macaulay Culkin. Okay, so something happened to the mom. No shit. She got clapped in the bad way. You know, there is a good and bad version of clapped. Look it up. Like, you can get clapped in the good way and the bad way. Act one, a new start. Yes. Isn't that something we all want? A new start? Akai's house. All right. I think we're ready. I'm really scared for tomorrow. Thank you, Fukoshi. Hey, Fukoshi. Don't worry. Everything is going to be fine. I'll be there with you. I missed one year. What if I can't get back on track and completely fail? Then that's your fault. You're not going to fail at anything. I miss mom and dad so much. I... I'm sure they will be proud of you. Actually, I talked to them the other day. They are so disappointed. Sudoku for him. Obviously, that's not the title, but I turned on the censored version or whatever, and they were kind enough to put Sudoku for him. What does Sudoku mean again? I'm trying to look up Sudoku. Oh, I'm Akai's really bedroom, nervous. she's going to sleep. I know that everything is going to be fine tomorrow, Sudoku. but I'm really scared that Fukoshi thinks about mom and dad too much. What does Sudoku mean? It says Sudoku puzzles might give your brain a good workout. That's not it. I need to try to sleep a bit. I don't want to be tired for the first school day with Fukoshi. Remember those days, everybody? Well, a lot of you are still in school, so you know those days on the first day of school where you can't sleep huh? because you're super excited? Where, where am, I? am I? Is someone there? It's really dark here. I can't see anything. Am I dreaming? I don't know, but I must run away from that scary place. That scary place? Move with WASD. Rotate the camera with the mouse look. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey, you're currently in a dream. You must find the exit. No, you don't say. Thought I was in Bikini Bottom. This place seems like a maze. It's amazing how you think that I didn't know that. Okay, anyway, yeah, you know how when it's your first day of school, you're super excited because you don't know who's going to be in your class and you want to impress everybody with all the new stuff you're going to wear. You're going to clean your shoes. You clean your shoes, you iron your shirts and your pants. I lost them. You did? I didn't know there was somebody to be found. This is very weird. And the way she runs is like me when I got to run in PE. I'm very strong, mom. I don't know about all that. I smell BS. <laughs> Ugh. Kind of smells like Fukoshi or whatever his name is. I don't even feel like I'm running. I feel like she's just doing like a scoot run. Kind of like a lazy ass run where you have to do it. Like the PE teacher's like, all right, come on, hustle people. It's hard. Wait, what? What are we talking about here? Yeah, you know when like they're like, come on, pick up the pace. And then you're pretending to run. But you just got done eating hot Cheetos and your fingers are still all red and shit. That's the life. That's the life for me. What am I talking about? I don't even know. But I can manage. Okay, whatever. You know, you're just speaking like a few words at a time. You're kind of pissing me off. The man bun's on a little tight. I don't think I have good circulation to my brain. Oh, thank you, Lord. Let's get it cracking. I almost fell in that hole. What is it? Where am I supposed to go now? Remember what your mother told you, Akai. Just follow the light. Who said that? Where are you? Are you here? It is I. Please. The Geico guy. Don't leave me alone. You can save 15% or more on car insurance. I guess they're right. I should follow the light and jump in here. Maybe I won't. Oh. Okay. Whee! You followed the light and ended up in this random ass school. And now I'm tiny as shit. But now you have to get away from this dream to wake up. All right, I'm gonna try. Hey, this music kind of goes though. Whoa! Damn! I got hops. Wait, somebody in there? 
Oh. Okay, hold on. Green. Red. Fuck. Green. Green. Red. Okay. Boom. Bop. Papow. No. I know what it is. It's that. And fuck you, dude. Okay. So boom. Blop. And jump. And pow! He gave me stop! You guys saw how I did that little hop? You know that little boom pow? Man, come on. Stop playing with me. I'm the master. You can jump by pressing space. I've been knowing that. What the hell are you talking about? Oh, now I gotta jump on these bullshits? Oh man, you gotta be twisting my pepperoni nipples, dude. Come on, you gotta be twisting my pepperonis. Oh, there we go. Come on. Shit. Shit, fuck shit. Okay. The middle one. And I'm gonna guess here. You oh, suck. Fuck. Let's go here. And this shit better turn greener than the shit I took this morning. Let's go. It's gotta be, it's gotta be that one. Damn it! I hate it when there's so much trial and error for no reason. Okay, here. And then I'm just gonna go here. And please, 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 please. Suck your mother! Yeah, buddy! Okay. Why would I wanna go in there, though? Wouldn't I wanna leave out through the exit where that green symbol is? Yay! Okay. This game is very interesting so far. This is definitely not what I was expecting when I bought this game. But you know what? Expect the unexpected. Sometimes the best things are the things that you never expect. That's what a wise old person told me that I completely made up just now. Because nobody ever told me that in my life. Nobody talks to me. People look at me. They give me one good look. And they're like, I'm not talking to this person. Like, he looked like his breath hot. And they're wrong. My breath is not hot. I actually have very fresh breath. I floss every single day. I brush my teeth twice a day. And you know what? I want to tell you all something. I brush my teeth in the shower. Does anybody else do that? I remember when I was in seventh grade, my classmates embarrassed the fuck out of me. Like, because I said that I brush my teeth in the shower. And they're like, who brushes their teeth in the shower? Let me know. Teeth brushing in the shower, gang. Stand up, please. Please, I don't want to feel alone. What the fuck? What's going to happen? Somebody going to jump through the windows and whoop my ass? Green gas! Green gas out your ass! Come on, man. I think this is the first time green gas was in my face. Bro, that's why I got pink eye on the daily. People always got people's buttholes in my eyes. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm making no sense. We make dollars, not huh? sense. Huh? What? Is it already time oh. to wake up? Okay, whatever. I need to get up right now. Yeah, because we just went through the weirdest dream. Me, you, and everybody else watching right now. They're like, what the fuck? Get ready for school. Bro, are you serious? Okay, let me see if I can get that drippy haircut. Let's go Kimiko, uh, ponytail or short. Bro, this reminds me of Yanchan's new hairstyle from Yandere Simulator. People tell me to check that out. I really do not give a double doggy style damn about that. What is this? Just like I don't care about this. Okay, I, I don't care. I swear I don't care. You can come in bald or whatever. I really don't give a shit. Oh. Hey, Fukoshi. Hey, I like this feel? beat. Yo, look, listen to this beat. Dude, I like this song. I'm sure everything will be fine. What mm -hmm. the heck? I'll join you for lunchtime. My classroom is right above yours. How do you know that? Dude, this reminds me of Persona 5. Like when they walk to school and then um, they kind of have conversations and then you can hear people talking Fukushi. and you can eavesdrop. Hello, I'm Mr. Tori, the headmaster of Cherry High. You're Welcome not Mr. Tori, you're Mr. Bulka haired fuckboy. Nice to meet you, sir. As you are new here, I'm going to present you the school ground and your teacher for this year. Actually, you're not a fuckboy, you're a fuck man. Alright, thank you. Well, um, Akai, see you after classes. Yeah, this definitely got that Persona 5 vibe. One of the greatest- What the- Hi! She hey. got here fast as shit! I'm so happy to see you! Amiko's on crack! Amiko, it's been a while. Or How Emiko. are you? I'm gonna call her Amiko, I really don't care. I'm okay. I was wondering, can you help me out for a little thing? No! Sure, what is it? It's a long story, but I just lost my phone. I know who stole it. Could you help me get it back? Please? No, oh, we gotta help this dumbass get her phone. Okay, I guess I'll help you. Alright. Tell me who stole it. 
I'll get it back. Even Akai sounds annoyed. See that girl over there? Well, what that's girl? her. I don't know who she is, but she seems really rude and bad. I'm too scared to talk to her. Nobody talks like that in real life. What? Hey! Watch those side eyes, Karo! Watch those side eyes! Who told you that we have to talk to her? Oh! Don't worry about it. I'll get your phone back. Fuck mm, no! Whatever you do, just Swear to remember God. that I don't want to get involved in any kind of fight or anything. These people anyway, side-eyeing me, man. Better watch what you're doing. Side-eyeing me like I side-eye some nice steak. I actually like my shit medium. I don't like seeing blood. So I don't like medium rare or medium whatever the fuck. I just like medium. You know, where it kind of looks a little grayish, but it looks cooked at least. I don't like blood. Akai have to get Emiko's phone back from Kuro, which is inside one of her classrooms on the third floor. You must find a way to distract her and carefully get the phone from her school bag. Or what? What are you going to do? This is definitely Persona 5 inspired. Definitely. Even down to the shadow people. Yeah. Even the layout of the school. So I got to find a way to distract Kuro. So this map tells me nothing because I have no idea where the fuck I go. Um, just find a way to distract Kuro. How the hell am I going to do that? Wait, let me just go up these stairs. What the? Ugh. Looking like some Ghostbuster situation over here. So this is basically telling me you can't go over there, you dumbass. So what I'm going to do, because I'm a smart ass, I'm a jackass. I am... What the hell am I going to do? Hey. 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 Oh, here we go. <gasps> oh. Hello, Kuro. Can we have a conversation? Can I punch you in the throat? Can I karate kick you? I'm not going to forget about you side-eyeing me. So I have to go to 2-3 once I figure out a way to distract her. But I need to find something, don't I? Wait, 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 wait. What's that say? Push pot on the floor. Why? Why am I doing this? Why in the Moby Dickens am I doing this? What happened here? That's what the bitch principal sounds like. It was an accident. Sorry. I'm really sorry. It was an accident. Oh, that's fine. Please be more careful next time. Could you please clean that up? Someone could fall on it. And I still have to show the school ground to your brother. Don't worry about it. I'll clean that one up. Once again, sorry, Mr. Tori. He just happened to be there right when I was pushing that thing down. That was close. That was random. That's what it was. It wasn't close. That was the most random dumb thing you could have ever done. But I need to find a distraction, don't I? I don't know what to do. <gasps> what? Oh, shit. Who slipped? Oh, Kuro is now distracted. This is a good opportunity to sneak into her bag and get her phone back. Ha! Wow, man. These women, they love drama, huh? They're so toxic. Search for Yumiko's phone. Am I doing it? What am I doing? Did I get it? Give the phone to Emiko. Oh, I guess I got it already. I thought there was going to be like a searching animation or something. Guess what? I got it. No way. You're awesome. I knew you could do this. Thanks a lot for your help. The animations are kind of smooth. I'm not going to lie. Next time, be more careful with your phone. Let's head up to class right now. We're going to be late. All right. She couldn't have just asked for the phone back and be like, why? Why did you take my shit? Don't you have your own phone? What are you going to do with my phone? Two phones? That doesn't even make any sense. Let's learn math. Bro, this shit's my worst enemy. If the result is right, press the button. Otherwise, don't press anything and wait. Correct answer. Zero out of ten. I got to really do math. Ten minus six equals four. Yes, that's true. I got the correct answer. Seven plus four equals 13. That's wrong. Yeah. <laughs> like I said, aren't these people in high school? What are they doing? Doing like third grade math. Classes are finished. Let's wait for Fukoshi in front of the school. So far, this game is random as shit. Supposed to be watching over my brother, but I'm over here getting phones back and so how doing first today, grade brother? math. <laughs> it wasn't that bad. Told you. Let's go home already. At least she's a cool sister. Me and my sister, we were too far away in ages to go to the same school. Like, by the time she was in high school, hey, I was still, I, was I think, in, like, fifth something. grade or something. What is it? As you're now back to school, we both need a computer. What if we try to fix Dad's computer for you? Dad's computer? 
<sighs> I mean, we could do that, yeah. He doesn't even want to do it, so it makes me want to do it. Don't worry. <laughs> what it's the fuck? Like a brand new computer. We will create an account just for you. Let's try to fix the computer together. Let's give this computer to a professional fix. Fuck that. All right. Let's repair the computer together. It isn't that hard. There's a bunch of tutorials online. Okay. Let's do this. All right. Sibling bonding time. Yay. Take the tools to fix the computer. Okay. Hold on, brother. I'm going to go get the tools that are all in this cabinet, I guess. Press when the cursor is in the colored zone. Okay. So, bam. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Freaking spinny shit. Fuck. Ugh. That's My hand-eye coordination is... Mwah! It's just mom and dad's sex tape. God. It we fixed it. Now it's time to create your personal account. Welcome back. We missed you. Did you? Did you really? Okay, let's see what dad had on his computer in the recycle bin. We can't. Ooh, what is this? Ew, what is this? What is this? Ew. Done. Be really careful with this computer. There's a bunch of memories of mom and dad in it, and I don't want to lose them. I will be careful. Don't worry. Thank you, Akai. The next day. I was just trying to segue it as best as I could. I'm not going to skip this. Because I don't know why he's... Hey. What's going on here? Oh, yeah? You want me to match make? I'm the best wingman there is. Well, I'm playing as her, so I'm the best wing woman there is. I can set you two up, whatever you want to do. You know? Over some chocolate milk. Because they're still in high school, so they can't be drinking yet. So over some drinks, but over some high school. What? This is the end of Act 1. The next act is coming soon in a future update. What? Oh, wow, bro. Come on, man. I thought there was going to be more. That's it, though. Oh, wait, wait. What's this? What's this? Extra beat. We got some Sudoku Night Funkin' over here. Beep, boop, pop, beep. Beep, boop, pop, boop. Boop, beep, pop, boop. Boop, boop, pop, beep, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Gotta get that Friday Night Funkin' feel, you feel me? Endless Midnight Madness. I think this is the demo that I played. Find all the keys without getting caught by Toka. This is the one that I think I played in the free random games. Yeah, somebody was here. A new key has spawned on the first floor. It's right there. Yeah, this is the one that I played. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. What the fuck? What the? Boy? Or girl? Shit. Yeah, this is what I played. Okay. So this is, uh... This was expanded upon, I guess. Galactic time? Hold on. This is the last mini game. I know there was another one that said customize yourself. But like I said, I don't give a shit about that. Jump through the stars, find all the pressure plates, hacking into the system, jumping through the fuck? Alright, let's do this. This Mario 64 shit. This is so weird. Oh my god, I almost died. Holy crap, I'm a beast, dude. I'm a beast, dude. Ooh, you see that? I don't even care. What the? Alright, everybody, but that's gonna do it for this game. As you can see, I completed Act 1 already, but there's gonna be more acts coming soon. So if you decide that this game is interesting to you, I will leave the link to the game in the description box below. Hopefully, you all enjoyed this video, though. If you did, make sure you give it one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude!